Well, when you think of people that are calling out for help, social media is one of the increasing ways that we are connecting with our viewers. Social media lead, Shauna Cowden, is here with me. Shauna, how are we hearing from people? And it's not just here in Canada, right? This is global. It is. So we have 33,000 people on our Facebook alone, and 26,000 of those are outside of Canada. We're speaking to people oh. from Brazil, India, the Philippines, UK, Australia, you name it. We're taking this program, we're making it international, and speaking to people who may not even have access to television. So what are some of the ways that we reach people on social media things? I remember like two years ago, you were doing Periscope, and then <laughs> just on Friday on David's birthday, you were doing Facebook Live. Mm -hmm. like you're constantly on the cutting edge of whatever's yes. happening. Social media is constantly changing, but the great thing about it is it's free, so everyone has it, almost everyone. People are walking around with devices and they're accessing them from anywhere at any time. So we're able to take this, leverage that um, option, the social media option. We're taking this content and we're making it available 24 seven. And so basically we're taking uh, scripture verses, we're posting those every day, inspiring quotes from our interview, uh, from our guests that we've interviewed and uh, impactful interviews that we see here on our program. And it's not just us ministering to them, but people take the content and they share it with their friends yeah. and then they're actually using it as a ministry tool. Yes, so we highly encourage our viewers to engage with our content because what what they do is when they like and comment on uh, a post that we have, they're essentially taking that content and placing it in front of their friends. The average Facebook user has about just over 300 friends. So you can imagine at least one of them doesn't know Christ. At least one of them is battling with brokenness. And so we're able to share our faith through social media. And I, you know, one of the most meaningful things to me is when we're off the air and some people don't want to phone those prayer lines, maybe yeah. they're intimidated. They private message us or they post on our wall. Tell me mm -hmm. about that because that's really growing. Oh yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So the great thing about it is it's, of course, 24-7, just like our prayer lines, but not everyone's comfortable picking up the phone and speaking to someone they've never met. So they will message us. They send a private message to us and we're able to dialogue with them. We send a prayer back to them and we encourage them to call our prayer lines. Um, I recently had one woman reach out to us um, and she wanted to know more about Christ. She says, I want to get saved. I don't know how that works. Uh, we were able to dialogue with her and after, you know, about a couple days, she said she was too scared to call her prayer lines, but we were able to encourage her. She picked up the phone. We were able to lead her to Christ through prayer and connect her with a local church. I love it. You know, what you do is so important. You're one of the faces that people don't see, but you're the hands and feet of Christ to this nation and to the world now. And just thank you for all you do. Thank you. And thank you for all you do, because you enable us to continue doing this work, reaching out to people, not just in Canada, but all over the world with the message of Jesus Christ. We need to be there to answer the call. If you want to partner with us and invest in this ministry and help us do that, give us a call, one 888 or you can go to 100huntley.com.